Twas the night before glitter frost when all through the town not a halo was stirring, none to be found. The diamonds were thrown into the air in hopes that a winter halo would be there. The fairies were nestled all snug in their beds while visions of the halo danced in their heads. Here's all the fountain stories and how you can win the glitter frost halo. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on notifications for any future Halo videos because I'll be sure to update you guys when they come out. And comment down below which Winter Halo is your favorite. Before we start, we have to take a look at what we're winning. This one in particular has antlers, which I notice is very similar to the 2020 Winter Halo. I love that this Halo have all these different toggles and it's not just a ring above your head. Also, don't be disappointed if you don't get it on the first try since it's not guaranteed you will get the halo by choosing these answers, but you will have a higher chance in getting it. So here are all the confirmed answers for the Winter Frost Halo. As the weather gets colder and harsher, more people get into the Glitter Frost spirit. There are ice skating rinks, snowball fights, snowman building competitions, and so many more ways to have fun during the season. The one that strikes your interest, though, is the annual Glitter Frost Baking Competition held in the new campus. It's quite the popular pick, and many students are itching to win just like you. What shall you bake to win over the judges' hearts? A. Glacial Gingerbread Cookies B. Cutesy Candy Cane Cake C. Prim Peppermint Brownies or D. Charming Chocolate Pie And there's two answers for this one, you can either pick C or D. After making your wish, you breathe in the crisp, frosty air and admire your reflection in the fountain's frozen waters. As the shy glitter frost sun hides behind the snow clouds, you decide to head to the castle dormitories to clean up your dorm for an upcoming exam. Before you can enter the campus, you spot a senior royalty sitting behind a stand next to the campus entrance. Curiously, you decide to walk over to the stand and take a closer look. While you walk closer, the senior royalty notices you and starts beckoning you to come over. As you approach the booth, you notice the senior royalty dressed in warm glitter frost attire is shivering. She greets you. Hello, I am selling some items to celebrate glitter frost season on this new campus. You decide to help a fellow student out and potentially give her items a second life. You carefully examine each of the objects. After many thoughtful considerations, you decide to purchase the A. Shimmering blue crystal necklace B. Nostalgic Ice Fairy Music Box C. Frosty Embellished Hand Mirror or D. Blazing Ice Skates And the answer that will get you a chance at the Halo is D. Blazing Ice Skates After you make a wish, you feel a breeze and smell a hint of fresh cinnamon within the air. You leave the fountain and head towards the brilliant school. When you arrive, you are greeted by the warm feeling of the glitter frost season, which ignites your spirits with a flaming feeling of glee. Close to the fountain, you are welcomed by a little girl who asks you to sample some warm toasty cookies she made. Apparently, Royal High allowed her to have a pop-up stall in the school. You choose to pick the cookie depicting a A. Jolly Snowman B. Precious Penguin C. Fancy Frosted Tree or D. Jam Filled Candy Cane And you can either pick A or C to get a chance at the Halo After casting another wish to the alluring fountain, you leisurely stride off towards the icicle-draped locker courtyard, marveling at the seasonal glittering beauty. A chilly wind picks up behind you, sending a cold shiver down your spine. Turning around, you see your spirited classmate, Breeze, is standing there. Hey cake gnomes! A few senior royalties are having an ice sculpting contest today. Her soft hair curls bouncing as she eagerly motions to the center of the snowy courtyard and smiles joyfully as you notice a couple of other energetic fairies gathered on a crowded frosted grass. You both confidently walk over and decide to enter as a team. Heading off towards one of the large blue linen draped platforms, both of you look encouragingly at the large block of sparkling ice and decide to sculpt a... A. Towering and tough polar bear B. Big hearted and bouncy baby penguin C. Cool and confident cat D. Dashing and daring reindeer 
So the answer that will get you the highest chance at the halo is A, towering and tough polar bear. After throwing your chilled diamonds into the glistening icy waters of the fountain, you follow the calls of your classmates to join a snowball fight. Laughter fills the air as you all scuffle in the deep snow, dodging and blocking the harmless snowballs. You pack in a perfectly spherical snowball and chuck it at the ice fairy classmate. The ice fairy gasps and swiftly swishes her hand to magically block the attack, though inadvertently enchanting the snowball with her ice powers. The game stops as a snowball shoots up into the air and freezes above you, its crystal white color slowly becoming entrapped in dark blue emerging with magical veins. It suddenly jolts down with power, and after spinning around to find a target, you realize the snowy fireball of strength is heading right towards you. You quickly decide to A. Accept your fate B. Jump into the icy lake below C. Hide behind a snowman or D. Run and to get a higher chance at the halo, you can either pick A or D. After wishing at the fountain, you decide to head down to the rainy day classroom to study for your midterm exams. You have been feeling stressed lately because there was only a week left until the exams and the glitter frost holiday break. You get cozy on a beanbag and take out your textbook and a piece of paper to take notes on. As you read up on the heightened powers of ice fairies during glitter frost, your friend runs up to you, an excited look on her face. Hey cake noms, me and a bunch of friends are going ice skating, do you want to come with us? You decide to A. Continue studying, B. Go with them, C. Meet them afterwards, or D. Meet another day. And the answer that will get you a chance at the halo is either C or D. After wishing deeply into the fountain, you decide to take a stroll around campus. The chilly wind blows into your face and everything is covered by soft snow. On your way towards the rainy woods, you see lots of students participating in all sorts of different glitter frosty activities around campus. At this time of year, the ice and fire fairies are the happiest. You decide to do something fun as well, so you pick A. Ice skating with the penguins B. Decorating the glittering trees C. Baking gingerbread cookies or D. Building snowmen around campus And the answer that will get you a chance at the halo is A. Ice skating with the penguins After wishing at the fountain, you gaze into its icy waters and watch snowflakes melt away into ripples you then eagerly make your way towards the annual Glitter Frost Festival. As the sun sets upon the glacial grounds, the crisp frosty air engulfs you, making you stir with anticipation. You pick up your pace while wearily watching your step so you don't slip on the icy pavement. As you approach the venue, you can see one of your fellow classmates, a water fairy, whose troubled expression causes you concern. As you investigate the scene, you realize her wings have frozen to a pole beside her. Knowing that lending her a helping hand may delay your entry to the festival and possibly lead to missing the show, you decide to A. Get her a steamy hot cocoa B. Search for a fire fairy C. Search for an ice fairy or D. Ignore her And the answer that will get you a chance at the halo is A. Get her a steamy hot cocoa As the magical energy of the fountain courses through your veins, it's combined with the chilly frosted air giving you goosebumps. Shivering, you decide to head into the school's office for some warmth. You notice a commotion of other students over by the bulletin board upon entering, with an effervescent poppy standing up on a desk. She is holding a megaphone, voice overpowering the room. The Glitter Frost events are here everyone! Sign up for one of the exciting events on the bulletin board and have a fantastic time! Heading up to the board once the area clears out, you decide to sign up for the A. Iridescent Ice Sculpting B. Snowball Royal Archery 
C. Enchanted Ice Dancing, or D. Glitter Frost Gift Drive. And the answer that will get you a chance at the Halo is B. Snowball Royal Archery. After a long day of studying, you decide to head home and to curl up in your dorm with a delectable mug of hot chocolate and a book that your friend recommended to you. Wrapped in your favorite blanket and immersed in the fantastical world the story has concocted, you don't notice yourself drifting off into a peaceful sleep. You wake up and find yourself dancing on the balcony of an opulent ballroom inundated with dancing guests and a chamber orchestra complementing the ebullient atmosphere. A swirling breeze of snow flurries playfully wraps itself around your arm before trailing away from the balcony and into the icy wonderland below. Feeling compelled to explore, you decide to move toward the A. Bustling Ballroom B. Glistening Ice Gardens C. Enchanted Woods or D. Cozy Library And to get a chance at the halo, you would pick A. Bustling Ballroom You head back to your dorm after wishing. You're joyfully engrossed in your daily login when all of a sudden, the lights flicker and go out. Summoning your inner courage, you dash outside determined to uncover the cause. Once outdoors, you realize your haste caused you to forget your snug attire and the biting cold intensifies. As you search for someone to shed light, literally and figuratively, on the blackout, the chill becomes more pronounced. Suddenly, you stumble upon an ice fairy. You seem to be very cold. Do you need any clothes from my closet to warm you up? They say. You ask for the A. Cozy plush hat B. Fuzzy snuggly blanket C. Sparkling blue gloves or D. Toasty hand warmers And the answer that will get you a chance at winning the halo is A. Cozy plush hat After practically begging the fountain lady for a halo, you decide to walk around the school campus. After taking your nice stroll, you go to see Poppy. Heading to the main office, you spot an arctic fox with wings. What a strange sight, you think. It looks at you for a moment before dashing away. Within a split second, you decide to chase the snow-colored fox to find out where it came from or what it wants from you. Chasing it outside the school building, it takes you into the snow-covered enchanted forest. You lose the fox in the forest, but find that there are three paths ahead of you. You choose to follow the A. Floral Snowy Path B. Path with Animal Prints C. Lantern Lit Stone Pathway or D. None Head Back And for this one, you can either pick B or D to get a better chance at the halo. As you make your fountain wish, your heart starts beating faster before you turn a leaf towards the rainy woods. Well, maybe snowy woods would be a more apt name for it at the moment. You don't know what you're looking for, but you want to embrace the glitter frost season before the snow begins to melt away. You step onto the winding path leading into the forest, hearing the satisfying crunch of snow beneath your shoes. As you reach out to touch the icy branches, the snow starts to fall harder and harder until you can barely see. There is a cozy cottage in the distance and a cave just down the trail, but your mind wonders if you should head home or risk exploring. You look around, assessing the snowstorm, and decide to A. Knock at the cozy cottage B. Shelter in the shining cave C. Adventure the whimsical woods or D. Try to hurry home The answer that will get you a chance at the halo is D. Your eyes flutter open after making your wish, and you watch as snowflakes gather atop the frozen fountain, eagerly awaiting a response. With no such occurrence, you sigh in disappointment to notice your breath lingering in the cold glitter frost air, but your thoughts are interrupted when Poppy approaches you. Hey Cake Gnomes, so great to see you! Royal High is planning to host a glitter frost ball for the season, but we haven't gotten nearly enough students to help out yet. It's only me and Alexander right now, and the ball is in a week. Would you mind giving us a hand with anything? If not, that's totally fine, but we would really appreciate the help. 
you respond by telling her you would love to. A. Decorate the ballroom. B. Bake treats to serve. C. Serve food and drinks. Or D. Just attend. Too busy to help. And the two answers that could get you a chance at the halo is either A or C. Once you have made your wish at the fountain, you decide to take a little stroll around the campus. You know that glitter frost season means pretty lights and decorations. As you look around campus, you admire all of the glistening decorations. You also see ice and fire fairies getting together and talking about the season. However, you notice a beautifully decorated fox glitter frost tree displayed for everyone to see. After viewing it, you decide that you want to get your own decorative tree to add to your dorm to boost your glittering spirit. While looking for the perfect tree for your dorm, you stumble upon four different color trees you like the best, but you can only get one, so you decide to pick the A. Cozy Forest Green Tree B. Pretty Pastel Pink Tree C. Glistening Frosty White Tree or D. Beautifully Blissful Blue Tree And this one has two answers, you can either pick A or D. So those are all the fountain story answers for the glitter frost halo and thank you so much for watching to the end don't forget to subscribe like and comment and make sure you stay tuned for the next halo as i'll be releasing new halo videos when another comes out i'll see you guys in the next one bye